Hey guys, thanks for subscribing to our Patreon. This is Jared back with another Recruit Film Breakdown. I want to give a big shout out to Aaron Livingston for chopping all these videos together and reading through my awful notes and trying to make up and down heads and tails of it. Uh, but today we're going to be looking at Oscar Cardenas. He is a 6'4", 242-pound tight end from Brandeis High School, member of the 2019 recruiting class who committed on August 5th of 2018. Cardenas had offers from UTSA, Abilene Christian, and Air Force. He's a three-star composite recruit on 24-7, and is ranked as the 91st best tight end in the nation, which seems a little bit low to me. Last year, he caught 21 passes for 351 yards and five touchdowns, and he's already on pace to very much surpass that output this season. So the first play we're going to look at here is one of two plays I picked out from their game against Stevens this year. You'll see Brandeis lined up in 22 personnel with two tight ends and two running backs. Cardenas is lined up in line at the left tight end position with a defensive end lined up in a 7 technique against him. The end immediately fires into the Z-gap to penetrate, but Cardenas responds with a forceful punch by getting his hands underneath the defender's shoulder pads and knocking him off of his pass rush. You'll see the left back take a counter step here before bouncing out wide to pick up an open blocker. Cardenas sets the edge with his block, giving the offense plenty of space for both of the pulling guards and the blocking back to pick up their blocks. Now let's flip to the other camera angle we have here on this play. You'll see that Cardenas does not get a knockdown on this play, but he completely neutralizes his defender and completely takes him out of the play. So if we look at the screenshot right here, you can see that you know there's a huge hole to drive through. Now it looks like Brandeis didn't get many yards on this play, maybe only like five or six yards, but this shot makes it very clear that Cardenas provided a big enough hole for any reasonable running back to make a gain on the play and a really elite running back probably takes this one to the house because there's a lot of open green space for him to work with. Now this next play is also from the Stevens game and you can see that Brandeis faces a third and long situation here if you look at the chains. They originally lined up in an empty formation uh, with four receivers out wide and Cardenas attached in line. Now before the stop, we'll see Brandeis use what it's called an orbit motion. So this means that the slot receiver is going to motion into the backfield and in this play, he ends up being a blocking back. So you see a lot of teams do this to run the option, and you try to get a mismatch against the defense by using this motion technique. So the defense is aligned in a 4-2-5 formation, with the safeties playing up pretty close to the line of scrimmage. The corners are showing soft man coverage, while the linebackers are not showing any type of blitz pre-snap. Now here, when the ball is snapped, we see the quarterback take a handoff to the running back, which draws the eyes of the linebackers into the backfield. The right guard wraps around to pick up the defensive end while Karninus releases off of the line of scrimmage. Now here we see the running back turn into a pass blocker after the fake handoff, while Karninus crosses the face mask of the middle linebacker. This middle linebacker still peering into the backfield, you know, expecting a handoff or for the quarterback to take off running. So, you know, this is where the free safety should be picking up the linebacker if he gets past the, uh, the linebacker here. But the free safety is still playing pretty close to the line of scrimmage, and he's actually looks like he's double covering this boundary side receiver here. So as the linebacker remains focused on the backfield, Carnitas runs right past him, and there's nothing but green grass ahead of him. Now the free safety here is thinking, oh crap, this guy's wide open. So he peels off of his double coverage, and he begins to sprint towards Cardenas. But it's already too late. You know, Cardenas is off to the races as soon as he catches the ball. Now the safety does have a clear speed advantage over Cardenas, who's somewhere between 240 and 260 pounds. But Cardenas knows that. So the UTSA commit knows that this tackler is closing in on him so he extends a fierce stiff arm that really drops the safety dead in his tracks so the safety it continues to cling on to Cardenas but Cardenas just drags him into the end zone for a touchdown on a really pretty play and a really big play as well as Brandeis is facing third and long here and probably would have had to either punt or try a pretty difficult field goal from this place in the field so thanks for watching guys I appreciate you guys checking it out uh, please let your friends know that we're doing these recruit breakdowns. I think a lot of people in the UTSA fan base will enjoy them. And uh, be sure to tweet at us, hit us up on Facebook, shoot us an email at alamodomeaudible at gmail.com. I'm curious to know which recruit you guys would like to see us break down first. We've done Sudden Sapien before and Oscar Cardenas was second. Um, so let us know. Some of the guys don't have film available, so we're a little bit limited in who we can break down right now. Be sure to let us know, and we'll do our best to make it happen. And thanks again for subscribing to us on Patreon. Your support really helps us and helps us bring you awesome videos like this. Have a great day, and we'll see you on the next Recruiting Film Breakdown.